What's up, the John Squad? This is John Hilling here, and welcome to an edition of Detroit Lions Talk. And the Detroit Lions had their first preseason game on Friday. They lost ten to sixteen. I have to say they didn't do pre they didn't do not too bad at all. They did okay, you know. I mean. We, we did pretty okay, you know. I mean, we just have to work on our defense overall. But I know this is just preseason, you know. It doesn't really matter. But it's about who wants to make the team. Who wants to see what they can do. You know, it, it, it all just depends on who wants to make the team and who wants to be there to make the team. That's all it just matters. And that's what it's going to all come down to, you know. That's what it's all going to seem, you know. Because I think that um, Matthew Stafford only got one play and then that was it. And then... I think Castle went into the game and he took over the first the, the first quarter then and the second then Jake Ruddock took over the third and fourth and then I think that they both did pretty good overall and uh, I think that it was just in a great game overall and we lost 10 to 16 though can't always win but um it was a good game though so that's why and I do believe in the Detroit Lions this season I think that we, we have our backs up against the wall. I do believe in them, but, you know, it was, uh, and LeGarren Blount, he looked really great, too, out there. He looked amazing, too, you know? I mean, I have to admit, like, it was just an amazing, good game, you know? Can't always win the preseason games, you know? It's always funny, but, you know, it's just see who makes the team and who doesn't make the team. That's all that matters, and, you know... That's all that matters, and all that matters is that the Lions are trying their best to win preseason games. Now we have the next three, and I believe, let me just take a look here on my TV. Next three games, we then next thing this week coming up, we have is the Giants, then we have is Tampa Bay, and then we finish off with the Browns, and then we're into the season, I have a feeling, and we played the Jets. So, overall, it's going to be a really good season. I have a feeling about the Lions, and let's hope they make the playoffs, and that's all i got to say, and let's hope, let's hope, let's hope. So, uh, I thought, and that guy made a great catch, too. He, the all the referees were reviewing it. I thought it was just pretty amazing, too, what the referees did, too, when they reviewed that catch, too. Like the guy just went over the guy's leg when he caught the football. It was just amazing, too. But the Lions were close to taking the lead almost. With 40 seconds left, you know, they were almost close, but unfortunately it didn't happen. But anyway, you know what I mean? It just doesn't always happen. But anyway, um, got to always stay positive, man. It's always hard being a Lions fan, you know, but we just have to stick with the ups and downs, you know. That's why. And it's only preseason, that's why, so... Just to see who wants to make the team and who wants to be on the team, and I'm hoping that they keep uh, Amir Abdul. That's all I'm hoping for that he because he was tremendous too, and I like him a lot too. So, uh, yeah. So uh, that's gonna do it here for Detroit Lions talk. So once again, the John Squad, please like this video, leave your comments down below, and if you want to see more Detroit Lions talk you know, for preseason and during the season, slap a like on this video. Leave your comments down below and subscribe for more. You're all the best of John Squad. You're a one of a kind. Live each and every single one of y'all. And let's go, Lions. Happy Sunday, the John Squad. Peace.